15th problem the seventh term of an ap is minus 4 and its 13th term is minus 16 find its first term common difference nth term solution given seventh term of an ap is minus 4 p7 seventh term of an ap what is seventh term a plus 60 is equal to minus 4 this is equation number 1 13th term of an ap is minus 16 p13 13th term is equal to a plus 12d is equal to minus 16 equation number 2 now we got two simultaneous equations now we are going to equate subtracting equation 1 and 2 now we are subtracting the second equation sign changes plus becomes minus plus becomes minus minus becomes plus when we are subtracting plus minus get cancelled minus 12 plus 6 is minus 6 so minus 6d is equal to 16 minus 4 is 12 now we want to find the value of d minus 6d means minus into d into becomes division so d is equal to 12 by minus 6 6 goes 2 times so minus 2 is therefore d value we got as minus 2 substituting d is equal to minus 2 in equation 1 or equation 2 also you can substitute no problem that is your real end wish so a plus 6d is equal to minus 4 a plus 6 into the place of d you are going to substitute minus 2 is equal to minus 4 plus into minus minus 6 to 12 so a minus 12 is equal to minus 4 a is equal to minus 4 minus 12 goes from left to right plus 12 a is equal to 12 minus 4 is 8 now we got the value of 8 a is equal to 8 the value of a now coming to what you want to find first term first term of an ap t1 we represent that is equal to a just now we got 8 second bit common difference we represent it with a small d we represent d we got minus 2 so common difference we got minus 2 third one they are asking to find nth term of an ap i told you nth term formula last term formula uh, general term of an ap the three meaning same only tn is equal to a plus n minus 1 into d we don't know nth term they are asking so tn tn means nth term in the place of a write a a plus n minus 1 in the place of d minus 2 8 plus into minus minus n into 2 so minus 2n next minus into minus plus 1 2 is 2 8 plus 2 is 10 10 minus 2n so this is the nth term what is the nth term means 10 minus 2n they asked to find any term in the place of p10 substitute here 10 substitute you will get the value no p15 in the place of n you will write 15 you will multiply and you will simplify so this is the general formula or nth formula nth term formula nth term of an a p Seventeenth problem. Find the sixth term from the end of the AP. Seventeen, comma fourteen, comma eleven, so on, minus forty. Solution given. This is the sequence or series or numbers given in AP. Seventeen, comma fourteen, comma eleven, so on, and the last term is minus forty are in AP they are only telling they are in AP means common difference is same now they are asking sixth term from the end from back onwards if they are asking from friend T6 means immediately we know T6 for is what A plus 5D but here they are asking from end from back onwards listen carefully from first means easy 6th term of given series or 
of an AP. But here, listen carefully. Sixth term from the end of the AP. From end means from back. So here, first term T1 is equal to A is equal to 17. Common difference D is equal to T2 minus T1. This we know formula. 14 minus 7. 14 minus 7 is minus 3. So the value of D we got. A we know, D we know. To find the sixth term from the end of the AP, this is the formula. Last term minus n minus 1 into D. This is the formula you have to learn. From the last term, subtract n minus 1 into D. Last term, how much they have given? Minus 40. Write that value. How much they will give? They have given that much you have to write. Minus of sixth term they are asking so n is 6 here. 6 minus 1 D. D value you have to substitute here. Or at the afterwards also you can substitute. Minus 40 minus 6 minus 1 is 5, 5D. Now we got minus 40 minus 5D. Sir, sir, I want to substitute here. No problem. Here itself you can substitute. Or without confusion you can substitute here also. Anywhere. Minus 40 minus 5 into minus 3. Minus 40 as it is. Minus into minus is plus. 5 3 is 15. Minus 40 plus 15 is equal to minus 25. Therefore, the sixth term from the end of the given AP is minus 25. 18th problem, first bit. Find the value of x for which the numbers 5x plus 2, comma, 4x minus 1 and x plus 2 are in AP. They, here they have given three terms. x 5x plus 2, comma, 4x minus 1, comma, x plus 2 are in AP. They are only telling they are in AP. When they are in AP, we know the common difference will be equal or same. T1, comma, T2, comma, T3 are in AP. First term, second term, third term are in AP. Here three terms are there. We kept as T1, T2 and 3T are in AP. And we know the formula for common difference. Common difference D is equal to T2 minus T1. And one more, D is equal to T3 minus T2. The previous term we are going to subtract, that's all. So here D and here also D. Both are the left side. So we can compare right side. Now I am comparing T2 minus T1 is equal to T2 minus T1 is equal to T3 minus T2. What answer comes here, the difference? The same will come. Then only it is AP. They are told already AP. So that's why I am comparing. Are you able to follow? So what is T2? 4x minus 1 minus of T1. 5x plus 2 is equal to T3. x plus 2. x plus 2 minus of T2. 4x minus 1. Be careful. This if you remember enough. The common difference is same. So we are comparing both. If you want to write this one first and this one next also. Now is equal to is there. Is equal to means difference you can write anywhere. Because both answers are equal. Now, 4x minus 1, minus you are sending inside the bracket, plus becomes minus, plus becomes minus, up, minus into plus is minus 5x, minus into plus is minus 2, is equal to x plus 2 as it is, minus 4x plus 1. Now simplify, 4x minus 5x is minus x, minus 1 and minus 2 is minus 3, is equal to x minus 4x is minus 3x. 2 plus 1, 3. Now bring x terms to one side, variables one side, constants another side. So, minus x, minus comes this side, plus. So, plus 3x. And here, plus 3 is there, right first, plus 3. And bring this minus 3, that side, plus 3. So, 3 plus 3. 2x, 3x minus x is 2x. 3x minus x is 2x is equal to 3 plus 3 is 6 x is equal to 6 by 2 2 goes in 6 3 times therefore they told to find the value of x we got the value of x as 3 if they ask to find sometimes they will ask find those 3 terms 
then you have to replace this value here. Here they did not ask. Practice at home. Substitute here. 5 3 is 15. 15 plus uh, 2 17. Here. 4 3 is 12. 12 minus 1. 11. Here. 3 plus 2. 5. If they ask to find the terms. Hence find the terms they will ask. Sometimes you have to read the question properly. Here they told to find just the value of x. Up to x you find and leave it. Okay. 19th problem. Find three numbers in AP whose sum is 15 and the product is 80. They have given a hint. Let the numbers be A minus D, comma A, comma A plus D. Solution given. Let the three required numbers in AP are A minus D, comma A, comma A plus D. They have given. Now, sum of numbers in AP is 15. Sum means what? Addition. So, we are going to add A minus D plus A plus A plus D. Add. Keep. Just keep plus. Addition. Sum means addition. Is equal to 15. Plus D minus D get cancelled. A plus A plus A is 3A. Is equal to 15. 3A means 3 into into goes from left to right division. A is equal to 15 by 3. 3 goes in 15 5 times. Therefore, A is equal to 5 we got. So, the value of A we got. Keep here. Next, what they told? Product is 18. Product product of the numbers in AP is 8. Product means multiplication. A minus D into. Bracket indicates multiplication. A minus D into A. Again into A plus D. How much? is equal to 80. Here I am writing in order okay, for clarity. A into A minus D into A plus D. Multiplication we can write in any way. 1 into 2 into 3 or 2 into 1 into 3 or 3 into 2 into 1. Answer is 6 or in multiplication. In addition also same way, the same of multiplication also. Now, A value just now we got as 5. Right? A is equal to 5. Now this is Formula we know a plus d into a minus d is a square minus d square formula a plus b into a minus b a square minus b square formula that formula you apply here is equal to 80 into goes to division 80 by 5 5 goes 16 times again replace a value so a square means 5 square minus d square is equal to how much we got 16 5 5 is how much 25 Minus d square is equal to 16. 25 plus 16 comes this side minus 16. And minus d square goes that side plus d square. So now d square is equal to 25 minus 16. How much? 9. Square goes from left to right. Square root. What is the square root of 9? 3. d is equal to 3. Here they told to find the numbers. So if they did not ask just they told to find they are told to find a and d up to here only. But when they asked to find numbers. You, you have to find numbers also before I told you. A minus D. 5 minus 3 is equal to 2. A means 5. A plus D means 5 plus 3. 8. Therefore, the 3 numbers. Therefore, the 3 numbers are 2 comma 5 comma 8. Therefore, the 3 numbers. Therefore, the 3 numbers are. 2 comma 5 comma 8. 20 problem. The angles of a quadrilateral are in AP whose common difference is 10 degrees. Find the angles. Hint they have given. Let the angles be x degrees comma x plus 10 degrees plus x plus 20 hold to the power degree x plus 30 degree. Their sum is 360. Let the four angles of a quadrilateral be x degrees plus x plus 10 degrees plus x plus 20 degrees plus x plus 30 degrees. Now, sum of four angles, sum of four angles of a quadrilateral equals 360 degrees. When we add these four angles, 360 comes. 
x plus x plus x plus x 4x 10 plus 20 30 30 plus 30 60 plus 60 goes that side 360 degrees minus 60 degrees is 300 degrees so x is equal to 300 degrees by 4 4 goes 75 times 4 7s are 28 2 remaining and it we are going to cancel like that 4 goes 7 times 28 here 2 remaining 4 5s are 20 so how much we got means 75 degrees x we got they told to find angles first angle x is equal to 75 degrees second angle x plus 10 degrees 75 plus 10 is 85 degrees third angle x plus 20 75 plus 20 is 90 degrees fourth angle x plus 30 75 plus 30 105 degrees